Yeah, well, thank you, and welcome back to Robot Wars Extreme Warriors. Surf Force a lot, lost a lot, sending Brute and the Conquering Clown into round two. Our next three contenders are ready to reduce each other to metal shavings. Let's go to the battle board and find out who they are. All right, Mick, we're going to see Black Widow up against Unibi 2 and Texas Tornado. I heard there's a Texas tornado around here. Yeah, right? yeah, right here. Well, you guys look like you're Texas and you're proud. Tell me about your machine. Our machine is called the Texas Tornado. We've got a lifting arm in front that can lift 200 pounds. Wow. We've got a steel spike coming out 24 inches from the rear with two side spikes, and we've got ramps all around the sides of the robot. How fast does the Texas Tornado go? Uh, we'll go about seven miles an hour. So you don't have any fear of the Black Widow or the Unibite 2? No, we think we're faster than both of them. You do? Yeah. Do you have any fighting words for them? Don't go mess with Texas! Texas. So you call your machine the Black Widow. Is that your name as well? Yes. <laughs> Tell me about the Black Widow. Okay, the Black Widow has two milling cutters that spin at about 750 RPM. We got a steel um, wedge in the front to protect us. Okay. Um, we're made out of Lexan. 14 inch tires makes me invertible. Great. And we got a nice spike on the back. Well, congratulations on being the one and only female driver. Very proud of that. Thank you. And good <laughs> luck. Thank you. I'm here with Team Duct Tape with the Unibite 2. Why do you call yourself Team Duct Tape? Because we use the duct tape exclusively in the robot for fastening material. As you can see right here, we have a lot of duct tape down components. So it's not pretty, but it works. Yeah, it works pretty good. This looks like a pretty mean part. What's this do? Is this your weapon? Yeah, this is the main weapon on the front here. It's a spinner blade that spins a little over 200 miles an hour. Oh, pretty fast. It's, it's pretty quick. And there's two teeth here to grab onto the other robot and hopefully rip pieces off. Sounds like you're good to go. Good luck. We'll see you in the round. All right, thank you. From Austin, Texas, Texas Tornado. Texas Tornado in at 176 pounds. He's got a strong flipping arm and a spike that's 24 inches long. From Leland, North Carolina, Black Widow. There's Black Widow in at 220 pounds, the only woman driver in Robot Wars has got a steel spike, cutters, and she's completely invertible. From East Provo, Utah, Unibite. And Unibite 2 with 211 pounds of spinning fury. That disc is supposed to do 172 miles an hour with a flipping arm to boot. Roboteer, stand by. There's a Texas Tornado team and the Black Widow team up in the booth. And there's all three bots poised and ready to pounce. And team duct tape for Unibite. House bots in this round will be Shunt with a Diamond Edge Axe. And joining Shunt, Sir Killalot, ready to do some damage. Three. Two, one, activate. Here we go as RefBot gives the green signal for some major bot bashing. Texas Tornado's in on the action immediately. They're trying to upend Black Widow. The spinning disc of Unibite is getting high-sided by that low-profile design of the Texas Tornado. That disc is grabbing nothing but oxygen. Well, the Texas Tornado's not spinning around much like a tornado, but it definitely looks like it's a control of this battle. As he takes that lifting arm right underneath Unibite, buries him over against the rail, Black Widow is definitely trying to prove wrong any stereotypes against women drivers as they are staying in this battle. They may be staying out of trouble as well. They haven't been taking too many licks from the other bots, but now, Dancing with death right here at Kilowatt as Kilowatt gets the pincers right down on one of the spikes of Black Widow. And Kilowatt doesn't look like there's going to be too much mercy in his mind. Black Widow gets out of trouble. 
Junibite 2 gave a mean lick on Texas Tornado, and I think it's immobilized as RefBot is counting down. If Texas Tornado can't get its button gear, Black Widow and Unibite are gonna definitely go through. Well, there is the devouring of Texas Tornado by Kilowatt, and Sean will probably get in on the action. Oh, the Texas Tornado, too little, too late, I'm afraid. They were already counted out. Something must have got jarred loose on the electronics in there. And now it looks like the house bots are rewriting the rule book and going after Unibyte, who's still in it. And it looks to me like Kilowatt just wants to have a little fun here. But I hope it doesn't just take out Unibyte's chances of being effective in the next round. And he lets him go. A little 360 spin just to let him know who's boss. Unibyte did not bite the dust and the Black Widow crawled away. But unfortunately for the Texas Tornado, they got blown away in this qualifying round of Robot Wars Extreme Warriors. Let's talk to the team. All right, the Texas Tornado, you guys were looking good. And then I understand you had antenna problems. Tell me how that uh, put your team out of the running. Well, when uh, Unibyte went over the top of us, they uh, bent our antenna down, and we lost control of our bot. You claiming it's a cheap shot on the end of uh, No, we had the best of them. It's just hey, I'm up. in here, and you're griping about it? I thought it was a, a hard-fought hard victory. And let me ask you, between the two of you, Black Widow and Unibyte, one of you is going to go on to face the Conquering Clown. I would consider it a personal favor if you really kicked their butt for me, okay? I would, too. They kicked my butt last time. Did so, they really? Yeah. Clown? The clown? Yeah, last time. Hey, I wouldn't mind. You get teased in school about losing to a clown? Daily. <laughs> <laughs> now, Black Widow, a uh, very impressive showing out there. Are you looking forward to taking on the clowns or whoever it might be in the next round? I'm looking forward to taking any man on. Woo! Not much I can add to that. Let's give her a really big round of applause. <laughs> so far through the exit door, Surf Porcelot and Texas Tornado. And those who have to fight it out are Brood and Unipite and Conquering Clown 2 and Black Widow. Well, <laughs> I guess you can mess with Texas after all. Their tornadoes, antenna problems, take it out of the competition, pushing the Black Widow and Unibite into round two. When we come back, two new matchups. Stay tuned. <laughs>